Too much water or not enough? This is the dilemma our cities face today. Most cities were not designed to handle the current climate and environmental challenges of flooding, heat stress, and water shortages. And in the next three decades, the demand for water is projected to increase by up to 70%. So how can we help our cities become more climate resilient? Well, at the same time, better securing our water resources and improving the quality of life for citizens. Today, I want to show you how, together, we can turn these challenges into opportunities when we see water differently. In many cities, rainwater is redirected from the streets, sent down the drain and moved away from the city where we can actually collect, store, and reuse that rainwater on rooftops or under infrastructure to help cool and greenify buildings and even entire neighborhoods. This also helps conserve our freshwater resources for drinking and agriculture. It's seeing our water as circular that is the key to solving our urban water dilemmas. In most cities, it's getting hotter. Temperatures are rising and the concrete surfaces absorb that heat, adding to the heat stress. But look up there. Where others see empty roofs, I see space for all natural, citywide air conditioning powered by lush gardens and greenery. But it's not simply the green that will cool our cities, it's water. Up to 50% of the hard surfaces in cities are flat roofs. So, when we see water differently, we also see that half of our buildings could be thriving ecosystems, nourished with rainwater, captured and reused on the roof itself. And looking down upon the city, where others see busy streets, I see a perfect setting for trees that have the power to cool down our neighborhoods, all nurtured with reused water and irrigation networks. With more trees and green roofs, we can help keep our cities cooler, and make everyone living in them happier. Now it's time to head down, all the way under our streets and buildings. Many stormwater systems are quickly overwhelmed with large amounts of rain, which leads to flooding and contamination of our canals, rivers, and lakes. But what if we capture and store the stormwater underground? Not only would this help our systems better handle large rainfalls, but the water could be recirculated for the irrigation of trees and green areas during dry periods, and then returned to the water supply via groundwater infiltration. Down there, I don't just see a drainage system. I see an opportunity to protect our cities and help secure their future water needs. The potential to recirculate our water lies everywhere, in every city, every building, and every rooftop. Smart, innovative solutions can save millions of liters and countless resources. We can reduce flooding, rainwater can be stored and reused, and we can transform our concrete jungles into green ones. When we stop seeing water as only flowing in one direction, and we start seeing how it can flow all the way around, the opportunities in our cities are endless.